Nefekari VII was the third pharaoh of the Ninth Dynasty of Ancient Egypt, California, 2140 BCE, according to the Turin King List where his name, Nefekari, is inscribed in the register 4.20. Nefekari is not included on the Abydos King List or the Saqqara King List nor can the existence of his reign be positively confirmed through archaeological finds. The pronomen, Nefakari, suggests he considered himself a legitimate successor of Pepi II Nefakari of the Sixth Dynasty, much like the many namesake Memphite kings of the Seventh and Eighth Dynasties. In some literature he is called Nefakari VII because he likely was the seventh king to bore this name, although many of his predecessors are now called by a combination of their pronomen and nomen. This otherwise unattested ruler of Heracleopolis Magna has been controversially identified by various scholars with a king named Carnefari, who is mentioned in an obscure and isolated tomb inscription of Angtifa, the pro-Heracleopolite nomarch of Hierakonpolis and prince of Elmo Alla, about 30 kilometers south of Thebes. If Nefikari and Canifer were the same pharaoh, his authority is sometimes presumed from Anctifi's inscription to have extended at least over Elephantine, Edfu and Hierakonpolis, the capitals of the first three nomwar of Upper Egypt. However, the inscription in question simply states, Horus brings brought her inundation for his son Carnefari. Uncertainty about the verb tense in the inscription has led to disagreement among various scholars as to whether this named pharaoh would have ruled in Anctifu's youth, or at the time of the events he describes, or indeed if it were not a king before Anctifu's time, who had ruled toward the end of the Old Kingdom from Memphis. Bibliography. William C. Hayes, in the Cambridge Ancient History, Volume 1, Part 2, 1971, Cambridge University Press, ISBN 0-521-077915, pp. 464-465.